Mmm, my hair smells really nice. Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. Hi, hello. Today is going to be the start of a vlog week. I'm going to vlog this whole week. I've just decided I'm going to do a daily vlog for a week. So today is Monday morning. It is Monday morning, and I'm not having a Monday morning feeling this morning. I don't know why. I just feel a bit, you know, sometimes on a Monday morning you feel really up, ready to go. Today I feel really down and not ready to go, and I don't know why. Look at my roots as well, like, holy crap they need doing. But I don't really want to get them done. So I think I'm going to wait until the new year. I think I'm just going to let it grow out and just let this darkness just keep going. Look at that. Wow. I'm literally a brown head girl. Is that a song? I oh, know. It's Yuma. Brown eyed slightly different. I'm not a brown eyed girl. That is never going to change. So yeah, I've literally got a week off work this week. And I was just like, well, what am I going to do my week off work? So I just decided I'm just going to vlog. Because then it will make it interesting. Because if I'm vlogging, then I'm going to want to do stuff interesting for you guys. And I think otherwise I might just accidentally sit and do nothing for a whole week so i'm gonna vlog it is the middle of october the weather's rubbish there probably isn't gonna be much i'm gonna be actually be able to do because it's freezing and it's cold and it's raining um maybe i should take some vitamin d tablets maybe that's what i should do because seriously the weather is not putting me in the best mood i'm gonna get up and you know what is even worse I don't even have any milk. So I'm going to steal Shauna's milk to make some coffee this morning. And then I'm going to go and replace it and put her name on it and put it in the fridge. Because I feel bad. But I, I really can't be asked to walk to the fridge. Walk to the fridge? No, walk to the fridge is literally over there. I really can't be asked to walk to the shop before I want to make my coffee this morning. So I'm going to get up. Put the news on. Yeah, I know. I'm obsessed with the news. I put the news on every morning. And I literally can't. Well, not every morning. It depends if I'm working or not. If I'm not working or if I'm working late. I put the news on every morning. And I listen to the news. Listen to all the horrible things that are going on in the world. Because who wouldn't want to to start off their day right you know what i mean like, look at the, oh dear my hair needs a serious wash i'm gonna wash it later i'm gonna go to the gym today that's one thing we're gonna do in this week i'm gonna make sure i go to the gym every single day even if i literally just do the tiniest little thing i'm gonna go to the gym so i'm gonna go and have my coffee and then i'm gonna go to the gym and then i'm gonna wash this absolute bird's nest that i've got going on here and then we'll crack on with the day god i look i look horrendous this morning i really do oh dear this is oh my hair needs a brush this brush is breaking and I'm absolutely not happy about it because I've had this brush for actually years. Like, I actually can't remember a time that I didn't have this brush. And I don't know what I'm going to do without it. And we're not just going to have to buy a new one, I guess. But it's amazing. Right, so obviously I faked hand last night. I'm just going to state the obvious right there. I think I look well tanned this morning. Um, sometimes my tan lifts really well and sometimes it really doesn't. But this morning it's gone quite well. Well, not this morning. Like, last night. I mean, I tanned last night and it's gone quite well. I wish I could be this tanned all the time. But as soon as you go in the shower, it literally comes off. Maybe I am good mood today i kind of just put myself in a bad mood by saying i was in a bad mood that's the key to being a good mood is saying that you're in a good mood anyway i'm gonna have a coffee five to nine perfect time to sit and watch the news and then i'm gonna sit and watch um this morning i'm obsessed with this morning i really am i i love it so much and our holly and phil will be back this week oh my god last week they were off and it was just dermot and allison all week and i like i don't like i didn't really enjoy it that much i am such an adult I'm such a stay-at-home mum. Oh my god, I literally sit and watch this morning every morning. That's so sad. I've been trying to make myself drink one of these every morning before I have my coffee because otherwise I literally just run off coffee all day and I really need to hydrate and actually drink water. So I've been trying to do that. Sorry, the kettle's well loud now. That's really annoying. Oh, look, it's a map better. Putting the light on. Great. I'm just going to show you how I make my coffees at the moment because I've kind of changed up how I'm making it. So, I put hot water in to like just over half maybe actually i probably need a little bit more and then key ingredient see i worked in holland and barrett for like three months and the amount of times i heard that mini honey was good for you i mean it's just unspeakable so i actually put a tiny little like like how much like this in of mini honey every day i don't know i feel like with the virus around and shit maybe maybe it's gonna like make me healthier i don't know also makes it sweet and nice without adding too much sugar so love that for me thank you so much holland and barrett because that stuff is literally that pot i got it for free because i don't know why it was i got it for free i think it was just like slightly unscrewed the lid or something but those parts of a new candy are like 80 pounds 80 pounds that's ridiculous i literally am gonna buy shauna a whole nother milk i'm not even gonna drink the whole milk i'm gonna buy her a whole new one just because i feel really bad Oh, BBC News is starting. Cheers. Good morning. Welcome to the start of vlog week. I sit like this every single morning. For some reason, we've got two sofas and I decided to sit on the 
on the floor. Um, also put the news on mute because it's so freaking boring at the moment. Sometimes there's really interesting stuff in the news. Sometimes it's really like, oh, like interesting like figures and stuff. But this is so boring. Like, sorry to say it, but it just is. This morning starts in 20 minutes, so I'm gonna watch that. But actually, oh, no, I don't know. I kind of fancy watching Squid Game. I started watching Squid Game, guys. I basically started watching it like three weeks ago, like when everybody else was watching it. And then I watched like the first episode and then he had like a knife up his nose and I was like, oh my God, I don't wanna watch any more of that because I just didn't wanna see him get his nose cut open. And then I decided yesterday, I was like, I'm just gonna watch through it because I was a bit bored last night. So I was like, I'm just gonna watch through it. And now I'm like five episodes in and I, I am obsessed. I'm obsessed with it. Don't get me wrong, it, it is disgusting. Like it is, like it's, it's brutal and it's gruesome and it's horrible, but it's like, so good so i think maybe i'll watch an episode of that but i do also need to go to the gym this is what i do every morning see i put it off and then and then it ends up getting too late god i hate it when it's like lukewarm <laughs> that will do i sit here every single morning and every night we're not here every night i normally sit in my bedroom and do it at night and write in my um gratitude journal shauna actually got this for me for my birthday I'm obsessed with it. Um, obviously, I'm not going to show you what I've written because that would literally be like hiding all my secrets. No, not hiding all my secrets. Telling you all my secrets. So obviously, I'm not going to show you what I've written. But it's basically just like every single day, you just, you just write in it. So I'm going to sit and do that now. And it kind of just like, I feel like it just closed my mind. I don't know. Or like, just like puts good things into the universe. I don't know. That's what I'm working on today. Morning meditation. Let's go. What are the dates though? 25th of October. No way. Is it 25th? That is crazy. Look, you write the morning one here and then the evening one here. And then you can kind of like reflect to see like if I was in a good mood in the morning and then it turned into a bad mood. If I was in a bad mood. It turned... It's just great. I really, really recommend it. Don't know where she got it from. But you can probably find them all on Amazon. So I'm gonna sit and go for my emails on my laptop. I literally sit here and go for my emails. Not my laptop, this is not a laptop. <laughs> this is an iPad. I sit and go for my emails on my iPad because I don't like doing it on my phone because sometimes I like I want to enjoy being on my phone. That sounds really bad, but like I like to take like my work away from my phone, so I do it on my on my iPad. I don't know, it kind of just makes it a little bit more like this is work. That's fun. Um I've got a couple of emails to go through about collabs and stuff like that, so I'm gonna do that now. I am actually supposed to be going on a date tonight. Um and like I'm not even gonna talk about it. Like, I just can't be asked. Like, I hate men. I hate men. I just don't understand them. Like, I just don't get it. They say one thing and do another. And I literally, like, I'm, I'm not even gonna talk about it. I'll let you know if I go or not. Right now, it doesn't look likely that it's even happening anymore. Um, but whatever. I just hate men. I can't be bothered. I feel like I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start dating women because seriously, like, men just they confuse me. They're a different breed. Like, they are, they are different. Like, what? Like, I just don't get it. Like, someone please explain. I feel like I need a lesson in men and their brains and how they work because seriously i don't get it it's a bit later i'm up i'm ready for the gym now kind of i mean let me show you yeah so i've wrapped my gym leggings on and my gym top and my trainers and i kind of made it a little cute little outfit like because it's like the red matches all the way through i don't know i feel like the best way for me to get myself to go to the gym is by putting gym stuff on because then i've already got the stuff on and then it's just easy but i am gonna sit and watch an episode of squid game because i can't help it like i love it so much so i'm gonna sit and watch an episode of squid game have some avocado toast to give me a little bit of energy and then i'm gonna go to the gym i don't know what i'm gonna train in the gym today i think i might just i don't know i'm gonna see what it's like when i get there because if there's people on the weights i'm not going on the weights and i would definitely do some cardio but if there's no one on the weights then i might do a little bit of weights i don't know but yeah this is my gym fit for today smashing making some breakfast before i go to the gym i have an avocado toast so these avocados have been in the I mean, they're only like two days out of date, but they're a bit, you know when they go a bit soft and brown? Ooh, it's disgusting. I've just been added to doing, I mean, added to doing, I don't you know. Basically, I'm gonna promote this um this club in Manchester and we get we get free um entry and free table and free drinks. That's pretty cool. All I've got to do is put up something on a Thursday and a Saturday. That's kind of cool. Yum, smashing. I'm gonna eat this, sit and watch Squid Game, and then I'm going to the gym. I am, oh, actually, I might go for a walk and then go to the gym because look at the weather today. How nice of Manchester to bless me on my first day off for a really nice bright sunny day and I feel like that's why I feel great because I always feel great also I have actually bought some vitamin D tablets so maybe I'll take one of those as well or maybe I don't actually need one when it's sunny anyway I'm gonna sit and sit and eat this I'm watching another episode guys I can't I literally I need to go to the gym I know I need to go to the gym but I'm gonna just watch <laughs> I'm just gonna watch one more episode and then I'm gonna go to the gym and have a shower and, and make myself look a bit nicer but I just can't help it I'm so obsessed if you haven't watched it go watch it seriously it's good. I need to put some washing on and I always forget to do it on my days off. Don't my teeth look so white? 
kind of because like my face is so orange i still haven't gone to the gym it's been like two and a half hours since i put my gym stuff on that is so bad but i'm gonna go now promise yeah look at this new hoo that we've accumulated accumulated not the word i'm not sure we i needed a hoover and i borrowed it from the concierge downstairs and then i haven't given it back call it theft whatever right i am off to the gym i'm so tempted to take you with me but I just, like, I will not video anything if there is people in there. Like, so the chances are, like, I'm probably not going to take you with me. Let me find a bag. I'm going to find a bag and I'm going to take you with me just in case. Just in case. I, I didn't film anything. Of course I didn't film anything. There was literally people in the gym the whole time. Like, once there was someone, like, right next to me. Oh, my God. Scary. Also, why do I look extra orange now? Oh, I am out of breath. I haven't done the gym in a while, so that was a bit of a... A bit of a difficult one, but it's fine. I think I did like 45 minutes of exercise, so that will do. I'm, I'm going to go on a walk in a little bit. I'm just going to get ready. Um, well, I'll get in the shower, get ready for the day. Probably watch another episode of this good game because I can't help it. Get a coffee, go into town. I need to try on some bits of clothes that I've got recently. Um, just see if I need to return them because I hate trying on stuff in shops. Is anybody else like that now? Like, before COVID, I used to literally go into a shop and like pick up a whole bunch of stuff and try it on, whereas now... That is never going to happen. Like, I cannot be bothered. I'd rather just bring it home, try it on at home, and then take it back if it's not right. I've got some things to try on. I've also just picked up two parcels from the concierge. So let's open those now. Don't know what that one's going to be. Oh, I think this is going to be hair extensions. <laughs> some hair extensions. These are literally just clipping straight hair extensions, I think. 26 inch five piece statement straight honey blonde. Oh my goodness. Okay, so this is actually for a Halloween costume, and I feel like it matches my hair quite well. I don't know, we'll give it a go. Maybe I'll put some in, maybe I'll put them in later when I get them ready, just to see what they look like. This one is from Goose and Gander. I love working with these guys because their quality of their stuff is just literally so good. Sorry, I'm not in the middle of the camera at all. The quality of their stuff is so, so, so good. Um, it's just like hoodies and stuff like that. Hoodies and, they do do like joggers and coats and fleeces and t-shirts, but it's just comfortable clothes for you. And this is what I picked up from them this time. It's just literally another hoodie. Nice sand colored hoodie. To be fair, I might wear that into town when I go. Obsessed with that. Thank you so much. I'm so, so, so grateful every time. I get to work with Goose and Gander because I just, the quality of it is so amazing. And I remember when I was like, when I was in school, I used to look at the Goose and Gander stuff on like ASOS Marketplace and see it on there and be like, oh my God, it's so nice. And I remember I actually bought, and my ex-boyfriend won't be watching this, but like my ex-boyfriend from back when I was at school, I bought him a Goose and Gander t-shirt. Like it was literally years ago as a Christmas present from ASOS Marketplace. I bought him a Goose and Gander t-shirt and now I work with them. So yeah, Sam, if you are watching and you remember when I bought you that, lol. Anyway another pretty beautiful hoodie look how orange i am oh my god I, do i look that orange i hope it's just in a viewfinder <laughs> oh well we're real over here babies i'm gonna get in the shower and then i'm gonna get ready i feel like i've been really slow today okay so i am the worst i didn't feel myself putting them in but guys you are not even ready look at this look at it look stop look at my hair guys i feel like i've done something here like i'm actually obsessed guys do i get <gasps> Do I get extensions? Do I get extensions? Oh my god. Ah, I'm sorry, I look like a whole new woman. I haven't even got any makeup on and I'm just loving myself right now. Stop. These are 26 inch straight extensions in colour honey blonde if anybody wants to know. But guys, okay, they are like, it's not 100% matched, but that is pretty close. Like, I will go with that. And every now and then it does pop out here, but do you know what I mean? Like, for the price, it is absolutely unbelievable. They have actually literally just... Uh, Reply to my um, Instagram story as well. I just put some Instagram stories up. This is actually not an ad, or, or it, these aren't even gifted to be fair. Other stuff is from them, but these ones aren't. But I literally just put it on my Instagram story and they were like, I'll give you a code of, like, if you use Ella at the checkout, you can get a free next day delivery. So I just thought I'd like pop that in there because this is actually for a Halloween costume. Like, I literally bought these for a Halloween costume, and now if you see me wearing them on a Tuesday at work, don't come for me but i am i'm honestly guys i can't i literally can't i feel like i'm gonna get everything on that on the luda bells website now i actually i'm gonna put a little bit of makeup on i am also gonna take these out i literally just wanted to see what they look gonna look like i'm gonna take them out because i do need to go to town should i try on those couple of bits that i might be sending back and i'll show you show you them and then if i do need to take them back then i can take them back but then i will have shown you them first let's do that god guys i can't i can't get used to myself i'm sorry i feel like I feel like maybe this time next year I might get extensions, like next summer. See, they are like a tiny bit different, but my hair just needs tinting and then that's it. Like, oh. <sighs> sorry. Okay, anyway, I've got a couple of things to show you. I think I've got like four, three, 
three, four things, but it's like three things. You'll understand in a minute. Um, so the first thing I've actually worn already, and I'm so unbelievably obsessed with this. All of this is from New Look, guys, like it is. I don't think there's anything I've bought recently that isn't from there because I'm trying to save money. Um, so it is all from New Look. But this is actually from the apricot section, which if any of you have ever been in New Look, you'd know that the apricot section is not the section that you'd see a girl like me in. But look at this. Look at this jumper. Oh my God, it smells, it smells well nice of me, but it smells nice. Does anyone ever like smell that? Like, oh, I smell good. Yeah, so look at this jumper. Oh, oh my God, I'm obsessed. Does this not give you like Motar Rocks, Livy Neil vibes? Because it really does give that to me. I'm absolutely obsessed with it. I love the color orange. You know that, so I... I, I literally just love this so much. So yeah, that's that. The next thing, I don't, need, I don't need to try that on. I don't need to try that on because it's just a jumper. But the next thing I need to try, and I've already worn it, so I actually can't take it back. Next thing I need to try on is this little dress. Now it's literally just like a little black slip dress, which is really, really super cute. I could wear it on a Halloween costume if I wanted to, or I don't know, like, it's just a black slip dress. Like there's nothing else I can really say about it. The straps just seem really, really short. And it seems like the cow neck might not sit so cowl, if you know what I mean. So I'm going to try that one on. And then the next thing, which I am so unbelievably obsessed with, is actually a suit set. If you went on the website, this is actually in the, like, the Lissy Roddy edit. But I actually picked it up before she, she made it her edit, so can I make it my edit? This is the trousers. So they are like a black pinstripe, but the pinstripe is like shiny. <laughs> I'm sorry, wow. Um, and then they go all the way down the front. They've got this like piping down the front kind of like seam detail, which makes them look so cool. I'm just obsessed. I'm obsessed with them. And I feel like they would just go with anything. Like even those with like that jumper is a bit of a vibe, do you know what I mean? And like orange heels, stop, wow. The trousers on their own, absolutely obsessed with. And then you're actually not ready. It comes with a cropped blazer, a cropped blazer. Look at that. How cute is that? Even that with jeans or just with like leggings. Like, oh. I'm so obsessed with it, it's unbelievable. I really hope it looks nice on. I got them both in a six. New look sizing can sometimes be really, really strange. So let's just, I'm gonna pop, I'm gonna put the dress on first just because I feel like that might not fit. I don't know, let's just try. And I was completely right about this cow neck thing. Like it's so high and it's like, it's just, the dress is just like, I mean, it is a bit cute. Don't, because I'm gonna try and convince myself I like it when I don't actually think I do. I feel like it fits really, in a really weird way, really high up. And surely it's supposed to be a bit worn down. Do you know what I mean? I feel like that it looks a bit like a 90, because then it's not that tight around my way. But when I'm still like actually posing, it's kind of cute. I don't know. Am I just making excuses for a dress that actually maybe I don't really like? Is it just cute because I've got long hair? Probably. Right, stop. This is probably one of the favorite pieces I own in my wardrobe right now. Are you joking me? Look how cute this is. Wow. If this doesn't give you like full on business vibes, I don't know what does. Can we just do it at the buttons? Wow. 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 Mm. Mm. These trousers as well, look, they could not fit better. They could not fit better if they tried. Oh my goodness. I will link this stuff down below guys. If you do want to go down and grab it, why not? Go down and grab it. If you do want a discount code as well for, for new look, I can pr I'm pretty sure I can get you one. So do let me know. Probably a 25% one as well, it's probably decent. If you do want one, just comment down below and I'll, I'll find one for you, but look. <sighs> wow. So I'm going out for dinner tomorrow with an old friend. I think this is too much to wear to dinner with an old friend. Maybe I'll just wear the trousers. <laughs> right, I'm gonna get ready, put a little bit of makeup on, maybe take a photo downstairs and then go to town. Go to town. I don't remember to take that. I think I'm gonna take that dress back because to be honest, I don't like it. Like it just sits weird and I know I wouldn't ever wear it. So I, I'm gonna take that dress back. Maybe I'll sit and have a prep on my own, like sit and get a coffee and I've got a couple of emails to reply to. Guys, I literally, <laughs> I've just been invited to a PR event. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> literally just from posting photos in this. I've literally been invited to a PR event. Oh my God, what? Thursday the 4th of November at 7pm. Guys, I'm going red. I'm getting all flustered. Okay, sorry. Oh my god, wow. So literally, from just posting literally photos like this, no makeup on, like just of Lulabelle's, they just invited me to their PR, PR launch of one of their new products. Like what? <laughs> like I actually... Ugh. God, this job just gets more crazy and more crazy every day. That's crazy. <laughs> on my own, I have to go on my own. Jeez. I mean, maybe someone else will be there. I don't know, we'll see. There might be some other girls that, there that I know, but that is crazy. It's on the 4th of November, I'm gonna go to PR. What? What? <laughs> 
this is so mad. Okay, <laughs> I'm gonna go and just compose myself, get ready, and I'll come back in a minute. But wow, a lot just happened in the last half an hour. Crazy. I'm ready. It's actually getting so late now, but I am literally just gonna go out. I'm just gonna go. I feel like someone might be home soon, but I'm just gonna go out, go and get coffee. I feel like lots of places shut at seven. It's now 20 to six, so I might just go sit there for a bit. I'll show you my outfit. I'm not really too sure on it. I feel like it's kind of like basically I'm wearing a crop. I'll just show you. I'll just show you. Hold on. So I've got this jumper on because I kind of need to take a photo in it and I might try and get my concierge man to take a photo. And then I've just got this like crop jacket over the top. But I kind of think it looks kind of cool. Like it kind of looks really bad, but it kind of looks kind of cool. I don't know, but I'm going to go with this because I think it's kind of cute. Because I was going to wear it without it, but then I'd probably get really cold. So I'm going to wear it with it. This is the fit. Let's go. Town. Right, so I've done a couple of things in town that I needed to do. I literally just had to go back to meet up and take something back. Also, look at that. Like, come on. But I did not ask you. When I put my eyebrows up, it really comes out. Um, I know I just sat in Nando's. I know I was going to go out and go to somewhere actually interesting. And then I saw Nando's and I thought, well, I don't really want anything other than a Nando's. So I've come to Nando's. I'm just going to sit and have some food on my own. And then I'm going to walk back. Although I'm in a shopping centre right now. And I feel like, if, I mean, yeah, it's definitely absolutely pitch black outside. So I might get the tram. I mean, mm, maybe I'll walk, I don't really know. It's kind of scary walking back at night. Also, look, my eye leaked, so like my, um, like that's really good, really nice. I know you're gonna think I'm well boring, but I literally just got a wrap and, wrap and mash. Call it boring, what If you don't do this too much, then you're not a real one. I'm home, that was so nice, I actually just, I love being on my own so much. I went into work, returned something at work, um, that dress, I just didn't really like it. I didn't like it enough and I need to stop keeping things that I'm not 110% sure on because I just end up having stuff that I'm not 110% sure on in my wardrobe, which is like, what's the point? I bought two thingies of milk, one for me, one for Shauna, because I said I would. Um, and now I'm going to sit and watch more Squid Game. Um, I really like it, like I really like it. So I'm going to sit and watch some more of that. Shauna is actually out at the moment. Weird that she hasn't been in this vlog because I live with the girl, but I, I literally have seen her like very briefly. So maybe I'll get her in the vlog when she gets back. I don't know when that's going to be. But for now, I'm out of breath. For now, I'm going to sit and watch some Squid Game. Oh my goodness. Oh, that was my, no, that's my straw. I've kind of been biting it a bit. Mm. Yes, I've just finished it. Oh my goodness, what a show. I'm not going to lie. If you haven't watched it, watch it. I was completely way too quick to judge. The first time I put it on, I literally was just like, mm -mm, no, not a fan. Um, but I literally only watched like 10 minutes. Like seriously, go and watch it because it's absolutely unbelievable. I feel like it's quite hard to get into like the first episode as episodes are with like long shows like that. They're always really difficult to get into at first, but genuinely like absolutely amazing show. Like, I mean, how many times am I going to say that? Like, I was hooked after, like, the second episode. I think it was, like, ten. Nine or ten. But genuinely so good. It is dark. It is, um... I don't even know what the words put it, to be honest. It is, like, disgusting. It is just vile and, like... But then at the same time, like, it's so true. Like, it basically... Oh, I'm not going to go into it. Like, you've probably watched it. The ending was crazy as well. Like, ah! I'm not going to spoil it for anybody that hasn't watched it and wants to go watch it. But if you haven't, go and watch it. I feel like I want to watch it again. But maybe I might give it like a couple of months and then watch it again. Because oh, what a show. What a show. Anyway, what am I going to do now? It's half past nine. So to be honest, I'm probably just going to chill. I'm getting my nails done tomorrow. But you'll see that in tomorrow's vlog. I'm going to vlog tomorrow as well. I mean, obviously, I'm going to vlog tomorrow. I'm vlogging the whole week. I'm actually quite a busy gal tomorrow. So maybe tomorrow's vlog might be a little bit more up, up and you know i'm also kind of worried that i'm not going to sleep tonight because i did have a pumpkin spice latte at seven o'clock like was that a good idea ella no it was not but it was very nice come back to anything more exciting happens i don't know if shauna's gonna come well she's gonna come back eventually today but i don't know what time right i think i'm gonna end this vlog here i started watching i started watching clickbait and to be honest i'm like two episodes in but oh god it's a bit a bit much chest ever jesus yeah i started watching it and to be honest it's not really it's i mean it is good but i think it's not that good. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Like, I'm not hooked, basically. So the washing machine is going, which is actually really annoying because like, I'm quite tired. Shock. I didn't think I was actually going to be tired because of my pumpkin spice latte, but I actually am tired. So I'm going to go to sleep. And that washing machine is going to be done, like, in an hour or something, which is really annoying because it just means that the clothes are going to be sat in there all night. But, like, what can I do about it? Nothing. I'll just have to take them out in the morning. So that is the first day of vlog week done i actually kind of enjoyed it not gonna lie but i actually kind of enjoyed vlogging i don't know i missed that i used to vlog every single day in lockdown so it's kind of nice to like vlog a little bit i don't know 
<laughs> I don't know. Anyway, thank you so much for watching, guys. I'll see you tomorrow. Tomorrow with another video. Um, good night.